if I knew back then all that it would take to actually get to this point, I, I think we would have been a lot more scared. It was very risky. I think technically it's a very risky thing to do because there aren't very many display technologies that actually make it. I mean, there are hundreds that have come and gone, and there's only a handful that actually make it in the mainstream. We use mirrors to bounce light back. The question really was, did it make a good display? I mean, I, we thought it was the most beautiful thing in the world. You know, it had that shimmering, iridescent glow to it. People often say, gee, it, it looks like it's glowing. Glowing like butterfly wings. In the same way that you see a butterfly's wings shimmer, or a peacock feather uh, shimmer, uh, that, that concept is what sits behind uh, every Marisol display. So we're able to take the ambient light, it strikes this surface, and then we're able to choose how we modulate it and send it back. It's a completely different way of making the color than other displays. It's completely different. If you can mimic that, you've got a pretty compelling technology. Not just from the value proposition, but think of the colors that you can generate based on that palette. As we move forward in the world of biomimicry and we look for real avenues of change, we're looking for companies to design solutions that are based on nature's designs. The Mirasol display is an incredible example of how business industry can learn from nature. And then you're like, wow, you know, it's nature is simple because Nature is very energy efficient and we can learn a lot more from nature with respect to uh, energy efficiencies. Anytime you can adopt and build on what nature has given us and put it in something that's in your hand that gives you much lower power, sunlight viewability, how could you not be excited about that? <laughs>